Asiatic black bear. The Asiatic black bear, also known as the moon bear or the white-chested bear, is a fascinating animal that lives in the forests and mountains of Asia. This bear is one of the most arboreal of all bears, meaning that it spends a lot of time in trees. It has a black coat with a distinctive white or cream-colored crescent-shaped mark on its chest, which gives it its common name. It also has long, bell-shaped ears and a short tail. The Asiatic black bear is an omnivorous animal, which means that it eats both plants and animals. It feeds on fruits, nuts, honey, insects, small mammals, birds, and carrion. It can also occasionally attack domestic animals such as goats and cattle. It uses its strong claws and teeth to dig up roots, break open logs, and tear apart carcasses. It has a keen sense of smell and can locate food sources from a distance. The Asiatic black bear has a wide range of habitats, from southern Iran to Japan. It prefers areas with dense vegetation and rocky slopes, where it can find shelter and food. It can live at elevations up to 3,600 meters in the Himalayas. During the summer, it stays in higher altitudes, while in the winter, it descends to lower areas. Some populations hibernate during the cold season, while others remain active throughout the year. Physical Characteristics The Asiatic black bear is a medium-sized bear species that lives in Asia. It has several distinctive features that make it different from other bears. The most noticeable feature is the whitish or creamy patch on its chest, which is sometimes shaped like the English alphabet V. This patch contrasts with its black fur, which covers most of its body. The fur is long and shaggy, especially on the neck and shoulders. The fur also varies in color depending on the season and the region. Some bears have brownish or reddish fur, while others have grayish or bluish fur. The fur helps the bear to keep warm in cold climates and to camouflage in the forest. The Asiatic black bear has a light brown muzzle and a black nose. Its eyes are small and dark, and its ears are large and bell-shaped. The ears stick out sideways from the head, giving the bear a curious expression. The ears also help the bear to hear well and to communicate with other bears. The Asiatic black bear has 42 teeth, including four long canine teeth that are used for biting and tearing food. The bear also has a long tongue that can reach up to 25 centimeters in length. The tongue helps the bear to lick honey, insects, and fruits from trees and rocks. The Asiatic black bear has a muscular body and strong limbs. Its front legs are slightly shorter than its hind legs, giving it a hunched appearance. Its paws are large and have five toes each, with long, curved claws that are used for digging, climbing, and fighting. The claws are non-retractable, meaning they cannot be pulled back into the paw. The Asiatic black bear has a short tail that is about 11 centimeters long. The tail is not very visible because it is covered by fur. The Asiatic black bear can vary in size depending on the sex, age, and habitat of the individual. Adult males weigh 60 to 200 kilograms with an average weight of about 135 kilograms. Adult females weigh 40 to 125 kilograms and large ones up to 140 kilograms. The bears measure 70 to 100 centimeters at the shoulder and 120 to 190 centimeters in length. The Asiatic black bear is smaller than some other bear species, such as the brown bear and the polar bear, but larger than some others, such as the sun bear and the sloth bear. The Asiatic black bear is an adaptable and versatile animal that can live in different habitats and climates. It prefers forested areas with dense vegetation and rocky slopes, where it can find food and shelter. It can also live in grasslands, deserts, and mountains, as long as there is enough water and food available. The Asiatic black bear is mainly active at night, but it can also be active during the day depending on the season and the human activity in the area. It is mostly solitary, 
but it can form social bonds with other bears during mating season or when raising cubs. The Asiatic black bear is an omnivorous animal that eats both plants and animals. It has a varied diet that includes fruits, nuts, seeds, honey, insects, birds, rodents, fish, reptiles, amphibians, carrion, and occasionally livestock or human crops. It can also eat bamboo shoots, which are poisonous to most animals. The Asiatic black bear has a high metabolism and needs to eat a lot of food to maintain its energy level. It can consume up to 20% of its body weight in one day. The Asiatic black bear is an endangered species that faces many threats from humans and nature. Some of the threats include habitat loss due to deforestation and urbanization, poaching for its body parts that are used in traditional medicine, hunting for sport or conflict with humans, climate change that affects its food sources and distribution, and diseases that can spread from domestic animals or other wildlife. The Asiatic black bear is protected by law in most of its range countries, but enforcement is often weak or lacking. Conservation efforts include creating protected areas for the bears, educating local communities about the value of the bears and how to coexist with them peacefully, reducing human-bear conflicts by providing alternative livelihoods or compensation for losses caused by bears, supporting research and monitoring of the bears' population status and ecology, and raising awareness about the plight of the bears among the public. The Asiatic black bear is a fascinating animal that has many unique physical characteristics that help it survive in its environment. It is also an important part of the ecosystem that provides many benefits for other animals and plants. However, it is also a vulnerable animal that needs our help to protect it from extinction. Habitat and Distribution the Asiatic black bear is a native to Asia and adapted to an arboreal lifestyle. It is also known as the Himalayan bear, Tibetan bear, or moon bear. It has a glossy black coat with a whitish crescent-shaped mark on the chest and a small white spot on the chin. The Asiatic black bear has a wide geographic range that covers parts of southern Iran, Afghanistan, Pakistan, India, Nepal, Bhutan, Bangladesh, Myanmar, China, North Korea, South Korea, Russia, Japan, Laos, Vietnam, Cambodia, Thailand, and Taiwan. However, its distribution is fragmented and patchy due to habitat loss and human activities. The Asiatic black bear inhabits various types of forests, such as deciduous, mixed, thorn brush, and moist forests. It prefers steep mountains and areas with thick vegetation where it can find food and shelter. It is mainly nocturnal and arboreal, feeding on fruits, nuts, insects, honey, small mammals, birds, and carrion. It sleeps in caves or hollow trees during the day. The Asiatic black bear is a seasonal migrant that moves up and down the mountains according to the availability of food and the temperature. In summer, it lives at high elevations up to 3,600 meters, where it can find abundant fruits and nuts. In winter, it descends to lower elevations below 1,500 meters, where it can find warmer and more sheltered places. Some populations may hibernate during the cold months, while others may remain active throughout the year. The Asiatic black bear is classified as vulnerable by the International Union for Conservation of Nature and is threatened by deforestation, poaching, human-wildlife conflict, and illegal trade of its body parts for traditional medicine. It is estimated that there are fewer than 60,000 individuals remaining in the wild. Conservation efforts include habitat protection, anti-poaching measures, public awareness campaigns, and captive breeding programs. Behavior. The Asiatic black bear, also known as the moon bear due to the striking white crescent shape on its chest, is a fascinating and elusive species of bear native to a wide range of habitats across Asia. These bears exhibit a variety of behaviors that make them a subject of great interest to researchers and conservationists. Let's see some key behaviors of the Asiatic black bear. Nocturnal lifestyle. 
Asiatic black bears are primarily nocturnal creatures, meaning they are most active during the night. This behavior helps them avoid human encounters and the heat of the day, as well as allows them to take advantage of the cover of darkness when searching for food. Solitary Animals These bears are generally solitary in nature, with adult individuals preferring to live alone. They have large home ranges and tend to avoid each other, except during the breeding season or when a mother is caring for her cubs. Territorial Behavior Asiatic black bears are territorial and mark their territories with scent markings like urine and claw marks. These markings help them communicate with other bears and establish boundaries to avoid conflicts. Diverse Diet These bears are omnivorous and have a diverse diet. Their food includes fruits, berries, nuts, insects, small mammals, and carrion. They are known to occasionally raid crops, leading to conflicts with farmers. Hibernation In colder regions with harsh winters, Asiatic black bears may go into hibernation to conserve energy. However, not all populations of these bears hibernate, as it depends on the availability of food and climate conditions. Excellent Climbers Asiatic black bears are skilled climbers and can ascend trees to escape predators, obtain food, or find shelter. This behavior distinguishes them from some other bear species. Swimming Ability These bears are also good swimmers and are often observed swimming across rivers and lakes in search of food or new territories. Vocalizations Asiatic black bears use a variety of vocalizations to communicate, including growls, roars, and huffs. These sounds serve various purposes, such as warning off potential threats or signaling during the mating season. Parental care Female Asiatic black bears give birth to one to three cubs, usually during the winter months. They are devoted mothers and take care of their cubs for around two years, teaching them essential survival skills like foraging and climbing. Shy and Avoidant These bears are known for their shy and cautious nature when it comes to human interactions. They tend to avoid contact with humans whenever possible and may become aggressive if cornered or threatened. Diet Omnivorous Asiatic black bears are omnivores, meaning they have a diverse diet that includes both plant matter and animal protein. Plant Foods They consume a variety of plant-based foods, such as fruits, berries, nuts, grasses, herbs, and leaves. In areas where agriculture is present, they may raid crops like maize and rice. Animal Foods their diet also consists of insects, small mammals, like rodents, and carrion. They are opportunistic predators, and they might catch small vertebrates when the opportunity arises. Honey and Insects Like other bear species, they have a fondness for honey and bee larvae. They might raid beehives or termite mounds to obtain these high-energy food sources. Scavenging Asiatic black bears are known to scavenge the carcasses of larger animals. They play a role in ecosystems by helping to clean up carrion. Human Interaction Unfortunately, these bears might also forage in human settlements for food scraps and garbage, which can lead to conflicts with humans. It's important to note that the behavior and diet of Asiatic black bears can vary based on their specific habitat, geographical location, and local food availability. As with all wildlife, understanding and respecting their natural behaviors and habitats is crucial for their conservation and coexistence with human populations. Conservation Status the Asiatic black bear is classified as vulnerable by the International Union for Conservation of Nature, mainly because of habitat loss and fragmentation, illegal hunting and trade, and human-bear conflicts. According to the IUCN Red List Assessment, the global population of Asiatic black bears is estimated to be less than 50,000 individuals, with a decreasing trend. 
Let's see some major threats of Asiatic black bear. Habitat loss and fragmentation. Asiatic black bears have lost much of their original habitat due to deforestation, agriculture, infrastructure development, and human settlement. Their habitat is also fragmented by roads, railways, dams, and fences, which isolate populations and reduce gene flow. Illegal hunting and trade. Asiatic black bears are hunted for their body parts, especially their gallbladders and paws, which are used in traditional medicine and as delicacies. They are also killed for their fur, meat, and as trophies. The illegal trade of bear products is widespread and lucrative, involving poachers, middlemen, smugglers, and consumers. Human bear conflicts Asiatic black bears often come into conflict with humans when they raid crops, livestock, beehives, and garbage bins in search of food. They may also attack humans in self-defense or when provoked. Human bear conflicts result in economic losses, injuries, and deaths for both humans and bears. To conserve the Asiatic black bear, various conservation measures have been implemented or proposed, such as Habitat Protection and Restoration Protecting and restoring the natural habitat of Asiatic black bears is essential for their survival and well-being. This can be done by establishing and expanding protected areas, creating corridors and buffer zones, reducing deforestation and degradation, promoting sustainable forest management, and restoring degraded lands. Illegal Hunting and Trade Control Controlling the illegal hunting and trade of Asiatic black bears is crucial for reducing their mortality and exploitation. This can be done by strengthening law enforcement, increasing penalties, raising awareness, reducing demand, enhancing international cooperation, and supporting alternative livelihoods for local communities. Human Bear Conflict Mitigation Mitigating human bear conflicts is important for improving coexistence and reducing hostility between humans and bears. This can be done by implementing preventive measures such as electric fencing, guard dogs, scare devices, crop insurance, and compensation schemes, providing education and outreach programs, promoting ecotourism and community-based conservation, and developing effective response protocols. The conservation status of the Asiatic black bear is a matter of concern for both wildlife conservationists and human societies. By addressing the threats and challenges facing this species, we can ensure its survival and well-being in the wild. That's all for now and thank you for watching. If you enjoyed our video and appreciate it, please take a moment to give it a like and write your thoughts and suggestions as a comment, and please help us grow by subscribing to our channel and sharing it to your friends and family.